Welcome back to the Clock Shop. This is Jim with J.R. Clocker on eBay. Let's see what happened at the Clock Shop this week. Hi, everyone. Welcome back to the Clock Shop. This is Jim with J.R. Clocker on eBay. It's Friday, the 14th of January, and let's see what has been going on this week. We had two statue clocks come in this week. Uh, this one um, is a New Haven and uh, it needs to be completely overhauled. Um, we'll be getting back to them with a tighter budget on that. Uh, we also had a French, excuse me for that, a French uh, statue clock come in, but it was so big that uh, I had the customer take it home. Um, I don't need it until he brings it back. I'll put the movement back in and then we'll balance it, make sure that it's fine. Um, let's just continue on because we had we have a lot going on. We had a nine tube um, uh, Hershey come in this week. This one here is just a little, I think it just needs a little oil. Maybe, maybe a clean, but um, it was, it was replaced by, by someone in 2014. And I just think it needs a little tune up. Um, it's actually running and keeping good time. It may need um, a new um, spring. Uh, it may be a little weak because it starts running fast towards the end of the week. And I can come to find out that they weren't using the chime springs and that, and they're all really nice and tight. Uh, this one is a crazy project that actually just walked in the door a couple minutes ago. Um, this was a sentimental piece for this woman, and she wants to see if we can put it back together. I'll have to get you. This was once was adorned with, with, uh, um, Decorations up the sides that came down here. Uh, it'll need a new bezel. Um, and uh, it had nice feet, nice decorated feet, and more decorations up here. Uh, I will try to put a picture of this clock. It is a New Haven. And so if you have one out there that uh, uh, is in disrepair or needs something. This one's in pretty bad shape. Uh, it was sitting in a storage unit for a long time, as you can tell. Um, I have, this is a will call. I need to get some more information about how easy or hard it's going to be. Of course, we're going to use this case, this movement, we do not want to change the color. Uh, this is this kind of um, decoration. We'll clean it off, clean it up, and see how much it is. You know how dark this color gets. But a lot of them we see are in a light, a bright green color uh, versus uh, this kind of almost drab green. So anyway. We're off to our supplier, and hopefully we'll be able to find that, some parts for that uh, one clock I was just showing you. Uh, but other than that, it's been uh, kind of a quiet week. Um, we're really busy on eBay, so it's nice to have a quiet week in the front of the house because we kind of get caught up in some listings and, um, and buying some stuff. And uh, we get to take Friday off and go, uh, go see a supplier. Some of the things we bought this week, uh, they'll be going up on eBay. Uh, we also really cool shit with the, the graver sharpener. Uh, and it's complete. Uh, I don't know if it's ever been used, but uh, it's a nice thing. Anyway, some of the stuff we're gonna be putting up on eBay. Look at this really spectacular early German clock. Um, just the patina is unbelievably nice. Uh, it's a 30 hour antique movement. Um, it is a one of the cast uh, 
count wheels. Um, and believe it or not, the pendulum is just as pretty as the front of the case. Uh, sitting here running good, just did an overhaul on it. The only shame is, is it has a bone minute hand and doesn't have a bone hour hand, which is really unusual. It's usually the other way around, uh, but no, not this time. Also finished this week and we delivered next week because we have a grandfather clock for this gentleman. And this is a beautiful, beautiful New Haven um it just i love the glass uh i love the the pendulum's cool um anyway i'm sorry i said it was a new haven it's actually a gilbert and we did a total overhaul on this and it's there it goes right there and uh it's a bim bam um very uncommon movement and it had blown up and uh, so it was hard to get uh, some of the parts for it, so I had to rebuild them. Um, anyway, that's a beautiful Gilbert going home.